How's it going everybody? Shockwave984 here. Today is going to be part two of our Full Metal Alchemist uh, anime collection. And uh, this one's going to be on the movies and OVAs. So with that, let's go ahead and get started. So first up we have the premium OVA collection of Full Metal Alchemist. And this is mainly uh, tailing off the uh, original uh, anime series, the first run. And like pretty much any of the older, or all the older releases for uh, Full Metal, uh, this is um, highly out of print. And there you see the four episodes, screenshots, and here's the little details. Some extras, commercials, textless closing song, trailers. And there they are, Chibi Four. <laughs> All right, and you do get the uh, English uh, dub track, and in um, it's in 5.1 surround and Japanese stereo. Subtitles are in English. And if you hear a fan, yes, I turned it on because it is very hot today. So, all right, here is the disc. So yeah, all of these. Um, that I'm going to show today, I found them secondhand, uh, all of them, because uh, getting them new could be quite the task. Here's the uh, reversible cover. This is them just messing around, like, hey, get out the way. <laughs> uh, so yeah, if you are going to try and find these uh, new or used, be very careful of pricing. Luckily, I got this at a half price books. It was only like four or five dollars. Uh, cause it's just like a set of four little episodes. So yeah, luckily, uh, found this. Pick that up. All right. The next up is the movie Conqueror of Shambhala. This is the special edition, uh, two disc, uh, set. Cause there is like a regular one and like a regular, uh, DVD, uh, keep case. And the front, the wording, it's nice and shiny. There's the spine. And this I found, um, or I have found used uh, many times. Uh, quite a bit. Uh, yeah, find this one and then the regular volumes. Here's the story details. And here are the screenshots. And extras. They are pretty good. Uh, the extras get like a, a bunch of interviews, documentary, things like that. Alright, English and uh, Japanese uh, tracks, uh, you do get 5.1 for each of those, and subtitles are in English. Alright, so that's the slipcover, and it's in this really nice uh, like hardcover uh, booklet. Instead of gold, it's fine, writing is white, and then here's the back. So on the front you have Edward, and then on the back you have Alphonse. And you also get some uh, art cards. Okay, so let's go ahead and open this up. So there is the disc one. I don't remember if there's any artwork in the back. No, it's just uh, plain. All right. So there's that, and then here's the, the booklet. Has like some pictures. Uh, I think like some interviews and things like that. Here's some of the like animation details. So yeah, pretty nice. And then here is uh, disc two. And let it clear. All right. And then here's the front and the back together. There you see the Elric brothers. Pretty cool. All right. And then here is the envelope that the cards come in. And yeah, the regular edition of uh, just regular keep case. Uh, I want to say it's two disc as well, or it might just be one. All right. So here's the first one. And then on the back, just has uh, the title. 
So yeah, what did what did you guys uh, think of uh, Full Metal Alchemist? Uh, you know the series, the original or Brotherhood, and uh, also what you guys think of this movie? I do remember this playing on um, Cartoon Network when it came out. I remember seeing uh, quite a bit of the trailers for it. Uh, it was very highly promoted. Yeah, I remember seeing this everywhere. <laughs> and see, it's like the reverse of the uh, first picture. And that's the same on the hardcover booklet. And back to the beginning. So yeah, pretty cool. Found this uh, for about... Oh man, I think it was like $10? I think it was. Um, so yeah, you might find this uh, edition uh, used uh, quite a bit. Yeah, along with the like regular volumes. Alright. And here they are. Or here it is. Alright. So Conqueror Shambhala, pretty nice release. All right, so now we're getting down to the last film. Uh, well, not counting the live action film. Please let me know if you guys saw that. And uh, so next up is the sacred star of Milos. I want to say Milos. I'm not sure if it's pronounced Milos. I'm excuse me. I remember pronouncing it uh, like the first way I said it. So. Milos, the motion picture. So yeah, anybody out there see the uh, live action film? Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, feel free to let me know what you guys think. This is a Blu-ray uh, DVD uh, combo pack. Found this, this with its uh, cover. Pretty nice. And here is the back. Here's the story details right here to the left. Get some screen shots. And then on the right, promo, commentary, making of, theatrical trailers. All right, okay. And the case itself, pictures are the same. And then open it up. So for the DVD, you have the movie and extras on one disc, and then you have other extra features on the second disc. And then the Blu-ray is just one. So you have, you see white. There's like a grayish kind of color. Then it goes to red. Pretty nice. And the cover is reversible. Get some nice like line art. That's cool. All right. All right. So that's the Sacred Star of. Milos, I think this played on Cartoon Network as well. I want to say it did. Um, yeah, or uh, I think it was on the Adult Swim block. Because uh, I was trying to remember whether it was Toonami. <laughs> uh, I think it will. It still was called Toonami, but it was mostly like Adult Swim on that block. But uh, yeah, I do remember this uh, playing as well. Alright, and then last up is also a Blu-ray and DVD uh, combo pack. Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, the OVA collection. Also, this, uh, I found this randomly at a, um, another half price book. So it was a little further out than the one, than the ones that are closer. And, uh, this was locked in a, um, cage because it because it's out of print and it's really expensive. And here's the, uh, story details here. And yeah, just this by itself was quite pricey, uh, but luckily uh, I was going to sell some stuff. And I know I do mention that quite a bit because, you know, I'm constantly, you know, getting, getting rid of some, like some older uh, things, like older movies and stuff like that. And luckily I put that towards this and got it for a good deal because this is, uh, like everything else, it's highly out of print. So first up is the DVD. That looks pretty, pretty cool. And then here is the Blu-ray. And get a farther away shot. All right, and the cover is reversible. All 
Looks really cool. All right, so that does it for all of the movies and OVAs for uh, Full Metal Alchemist. And I'm not sure if the Netflix live action movie is going to get a release out here in the States. I don't think it ever did. Like the uh, uh, Bleach film. Uh, there's some other ones as well. Yeah. Uh, but uh, I, I would maybe check that out. Possibly if it did. Um, but uh, I do remember seeing it. Or seeing it. Seeing it. Sorry about that guys. And uh, y'all thought it was uh, pretty good. Pretty, you know, different. Knowing it, it's live action. That was quite the task. <laughs> Alright. So let's go ahead and display all these. So let's put Shambhala to the left. That one right there. Okay. All right. And there they are. All look pretty good. So yeah, all the movies, OVAs, uh, really nice additions, um, and, you know, as I mentioned before, these are highly out of print now, um, you know, getting them new could be, you know, pretty pricey, so do be careful, do be aware, um, also, the, uh, so there is a new set, or two box sets, that are out, and I couldn't remember if it was on the original series or Brotherhood, they're actually for Brotherhood. So, the first series doesn't have a new release, as far as I can tell so far. Uh, like, once the rights reverted back to Antiplex, it has released uh, two box sets for Brotherhood. But not the original, which is kind of strange. Because um, I think that deserves a re-release. And it's on Blu-ray, too, is what they did for Brotherhood. Uh, which is, you know, nice. But, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird. Uh, so yeah, do be careful, but, uh, Full Metal Alchemist, awesome series, you know, the movies are cool, OVAs, you know, nice and fun, and, uh, yeah, I would highly recommend checking out FMA, whether it be the original or, uh, Brotherhood, just check out both. Also, I heard the manga's pretty good, and, uh, yeah, so with that, I will see you guys next time, stay tuned for the last part. See you later, guys.